looks like we're back up. Uh, okay, sorry about that so much. Uh, yeah, that, um, that, uh, that, that was really weird. My, my, my entire computer just completely froze, so that's never happened time, before, so we'll, uh, we'll try that again. <laughs> time, time to get a new computer. <laughs> this, uh, the, the, the problem is this computer's not that old, though. <laughs> Dude, you realize that you like ran past a bunch of vending machines, right? I can't. Like... I can't interact with them. I gotta go to oh. a store. Yeah, they're kind of weird about that. There we go. Yeah, you you, you can interact with the uh, vending machines uh, later in um in in, in the other Yakuza games, but. Uh, yeah, like in number two, in fact, there's, a, there's an achievement for drinking all the all the vending machines, all what the vending machine has to offer. Or not an achievement, but like a uh, completion task. So remember, when you go back to Japan, it's considered rude to walk and drink at the same time. That's interesting. I wonder why. I can't remember, like, you know, they don't, they consider walking and eating, like, a rude thing. So, that's why, like, you know, when, like, if you're gonna drink outside, right, they prefer you to drink near the vending machine, that's why they have the recycle bins there, so. I see. Cause, yeah, I remember one time, yeah, cause I remember that when, one time, I remember when I went to Japan, I, I, I bought myself, like, a Coke, and as I was drinking it, like, I was, like, and after I finished drinking it, I was like, there's no recycling around me. Like, anywhere. Right. <laughs> yeah, like, there are only very few garbage cans. Like, you'll find garbage cans in convenience stores, actually. I, I'll have to remember that next time. They, yeah, I was actually even surprised. There was not even one in the, uh, in, 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 in like, the bathrooms. Right, but, well, no, they garbage cans in the bath. That's where they, you know, where they put the paper towels. But actually, some of the bathrooms in Japan don't have uh, things because, um, because you're like in some of the places you're expected to bring your own hand towel. That's true, yeah. Yumi. What are they? Uh oh. I'm tired. Yeah, it's got That literally means tired. Oh, I see. Yeah. Oh god, okay, gotta answer this. Ugh. But, uh, long story short, I am holding a child I do not know. <laughs> Let me spin you away. <laughs> Oh god. <laughs> I want to punch like you in the face. <laughs> I'd like to punch you in the face. It's like, I don't have time for this. You allowed that punk to punch you in the back? Well, I don't know. The, the, the sound got out of sync again, and I was just checking it on the stream to make sure that it's not the case there. I'll have to nope, look up. It is. It, it was, but then I, I'm certain that it'll.
No, she's not. Oh, I see. <laughs> well, no, but no need to alert the police about that. Oh, God damn it. You know, it's so funny. With the way that this game is going, it's like they really are portraying Japan as a not a, as not a very safe country. <laughs> it's like every few steps you take, you get into a fight. Yeah, that's true. And then punks trying to rob you. But these are. But this is a more uh, like I don't want to say crime controlled area, but it is. Because, you know, Tokyo being as big as it is, there are some kind of, you know, not-so-safe districts for you to be wandering around in. Oh, God damn it! <laughs> <laughs> I know, just random people just coming out of the woodwork going, Hey! You're walking here! I want to fight you now! <laughs> Is the, um... Sounds laggy on your end, isn't it? Not as bad as the last time you fought. Oh, okay. It is like really off for me for some reason, but yeah, I have to. I really have to look into figuring out how that, why that's happening, because yeah, it's not, it's not laggy on the stream, so that's that's like really good, but like yeah, it does. Lena, Konoko.伊達さんっていう刑事さんから電話で聞いたわ。熱があるみたいね。奥の部屋に行っててくれる今薬持ってくるから。ええ、頼む。さてと、薬も飲ませたし、あとは寝ていれば大丈夫よ。きっと一時
いいでしょ他にどうしようもねえな And now we're going back into like the lone wolf and cub type of thing, which is what they probably based the Mandalorian off of. And now what you're doing. I mean, you know. I'm trying to think of any other movies that. Like, it's funny that I, I, that, I don't know, there hasn't been like a Western version of lone wolf and cub yet, considering how. Surprisingly interchangeable the、uh, the Western genre and the and the samurai genre are. Yeah. Hmm. I just recently found out. Maybe I was in that place. I don't know. 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 おじさんはなんでお母さんを探してるの？話すと長くなるが、俺は弓を探しているんだ。それで妹の水木。つまりお前のお母さんなら何か知ってるんじゃないかと思ってな。そうなんだ。弓お姉ちゃんもどこ行っちゃったんだろう。お前は。I love how that's just this drunk guy right here. He's <laughs> just like. The bar is all set. Uh oh. Oh, she's just this girl that I met today. What do you think I should do? That's right. I know I'm not. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> <laughs> let's let's see if I can lie to him.、Uh, yeah, sure. Ah, 本当にじゃ身分証明できるもんある？ Why would I? Why would I? Yeah. ね身分証明書もないの。困ったね。二人とも悪いけど、ショーまで来てくれる。ダメだよおじさん。私ひまわりに連れ戻されちゃう。All right, that looks like I have to fight him. ほら、行くぞ。We need to run. ん？何やってんの？今逃げようとしたね。なんで逃げようとするんだね？あ？はい、そこまで。ああ、おまわりさん。なんだい。これ以上お父さんのこといじめないで。は？お父さん見た目の割に気が小さいの。だからさっきから動転しちゃってて、父に代わってお詫びします。だからもういじめないでください。ああ、じゃあ本当にお父さんなんだね。はい。お父さん、あんたいい娘さん持ったね。あんたももうちょっとしっかりしなくちゃな。もういいですか ？Excuse you, you.。I know, yeah. いいよ。You're the one who just assumed that I was kidnapping her just because I looked super suspicious. 手紙を届けに来てくれたんだろう。Gotta cough him up. I gotta duck. You mean you cut the yellow? Yeah, see, that's why I could never be a police officer. I'd be just like that guy. Ah, so da. What did you say? Jimmy, your mom, recently changed shampoo. Your hair is so beautiful. I thought it was so nice. Ah, so now we got to go to the Millennium Tower. We got to find the Millennium Falcon. Yeah. <laughs> yes, the Millennium, the Millennium Falcon. Look at this place, though. What's weird is that when you actually go inside it, it's it feels really vacant. 
この中に店を構えるなんて簡単にできることじゃない And I have no connection or knowledge about this building whatsoever, <laughs> even though it was the crux of the last game. Technically, he doesn't, you know? He, yeah, that's true. Yeah, because like, all of it is, the, is, is just the... Uh... Man, you know what, though? Like, after watching this, it's like, I really want to go to Kizuki. Ramen, or the ramen restaurant here now. Yeah, you know, you didn't. Yeah, we weren't able to go there the last time I was I was up with you. Yeah, well, you, you'll, 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 you'll go when you come up in March. Now, so don't worry. Yeah, I'd like to try, especially if they have a uh, tsukemen. Yeah. In fact, actually, maybe we can we can we can go the day you come up. Yeah, actually, that I'd be I wouldn't be opposed to that. Nothing like a good bowl of tsukemen. <laughs> I always describe tsukemen like the uh, decon like as a deconstructed ramen. <laughs> How did you do that? God, how the hell did she get a bar? Got an unknown sister that we've never heard of. Even though, also, Yumi grew up in an orphanage, so that's kind of weird. Yeah, I thought that was weird. でもその時思った私本当にもうお母さんと会えなくなるかもしれないって。What a surprise! More guys for you. I know, yeah. <laughs> well, people are always watching my move. あんた、キリオさんでっか。元同時マグミのお初にお目にかかります。わし。Ah, he's part of the Omi Alliance. Hiroshi Hayashi. Omi Rengo te koto wa Nishikiyama ni tanomare ta no ka? Ore o neratte ru ndaro. Yeah. We want the girl. <laughs> Everybody wants the girl. Dozo kinsen to totto gun nare ya. <laughs> oh, good, these are polite hitmen. <laughs><笑><笑> あ。そうか。お前らも弓と水木を。いや、わしらが夫のはそこのお嬢さんですわ。Oh 
<laughs> Be a pal and hand her over. <laughs> like, yeah. Yeah, it's like... <laughs> Also, like if she, if Miz if Mizuki owns this bar, like where it does is, is is this place locked at all? <laughs> I mean, it did have a security code in order to get in. I guess so, but how the hell did these guys know that? And now it's time for you to beat them up. Yeah, but Hayashi is. He's a boss, if you couldn't tell. That's why he gets his own title card. <laughs> hey okay, I'm gonna go freestyle on you. It's not, um, it's not lagging anymore, by the way. Yeah, it's not for me anymore either. It just usually has to get to, to through like a, a loading screen and then it kind of writes itself. Nobody will know we were here. <laughs> Ow. Stop allowing yourself to get hurt, Kazuo. Unfortunately, the beast style is kind of slow, if you've noticed. Where's Majima when you need him? I know, right? This guy. You need that break. <laughs> That breakdancing style. I know, right? <laughs> yeah. Take out the weaker ones first, yes. But then check the pawns go first. Oh god. Oh. When I saw that, I just, I heard the uh, Street Fighter. Oh yeah, the, the, the stars. <laughs> Speaking of... Rush move on him. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. Oh, Jesus. Oh, wow. He can grab shit, too? Oh, God. Oh. Uh, might need to take a bit of a... Uh, <laughs> time out, time out, time out! <laughs> Alright, time in! <laughs> oh, yeah. No more time out, Carbon. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. I'm gonna grab that. There was a challenge on the original Yakuza that was, um, it, it, it like, I actually was really, I, I don't know what it was, but I got super dedicated to trying to beat it, but, um, you go through the entire game, and you, and you fight every major battle, and you have to do it all in one life without, without dying, <laughs> and, um, you do Grab get, him. Grab him. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. I can't believe that's... I can't believe that slap really disorients me, so... There we go. End of the wall. But, um, yeah, you have to do every major battle, and... You do get healing items, but... You, and, and you can find... You can pick up any healing items that you see, but my God, it took me... I think an hour and a half to do the entire thing. That was back when I had all the time in the world to be able to just play one video game for hours. I can't do that anymore. You know, like, my eyes start to hurt. It means you're an adult. Yeah. Also, I, well, I also think it has something to do with, like, you know, these new... <laughs> these new fangled HD TVs. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> Actually, it would be it would be very apparent, you know, because if her mom is the one who stole that money, all they need to do is hold the girl hostage, and the mom's gonna come out and save her. I don't know though, because she's been living in an orphanage. She probably figured that that would be the safest place for her to be. Like, if no one knew she had a daughter, right? yeah, that's true. 
But then why do it to begin with? That's the question. Oh. Ah, seeing more of Nishiki's story. Ooh. Yeah, unfortunately, we never see her see his sister, but yeah, she's not doing good at all. Yeah. We need a heart. Yeah, 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 yeah, that's the... Anything? <laughs> Whatever it takes. <laughs> Anything that I want. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> oh. You see, there's this competition where a bunch of people will ki will will play children's games and they get killed off systematically. We've got organs from some of the dead players, so. <laughs> See, so that was a squid, squid game reference. Yeah, thank you. Ooh, Jesus. Yeah, it sucks that we're not in the economic boom that we were in the first game, because Nishiki could probably get that by just fighting a couple people. <laughs> うん。君長さん。松木。おお。マイガード。何の真似だ。俺に金を稼がせてくれ。3000万。どうしても必要なんだ。Damn, he is desperate, considering it's like, this guy is probably the last person you want to be owing a favor to. <laughs> Everyone is doing the, like, anything that I want. <laughs> hey, you'd, you'd be exactly the same. I would not. Yeah. I am insulted you would even insinuate Oh, please. I mean, you probably wouldn't go as far as... Yeah, you wouldn't do that, but, like, you would... <laughs> if somebody gave you the opportunity to say that, you would. <laughs> Ugh. Yeah, you know, these... Though, these, uh... That's what I love about, like, this game, is that, like, it just sheds so much more light on... On all of, on, like, you know, Nishiki and what he was doing, because, like, we didn't... We never got to see this in the, in the actual, in the first, in the original game. And I am getting hungry. I'm actually probably going to make some stir-fried pork for dinner tonight. Nice. Oh, Shinji still does. <laughs> yeah, that's funny. Shinji still calls him Aniki. Aniki. <laughs> あの状況から見て、親さんを撃ったのは登場会のもんです。親さんの居所が知れたら、また狙われるかもしれません。今どこだ？信頼できる筋に隠れが頼んでるとこです。落ち着いたら、また連絡します。連絡先はセレナで。
Well, what do I do now? <laughs> Kazama-san, you lived there, right? You were good. Kiryu, do you have any questions? No, I don't think I'm going to be able to get the information. I'm going to get the information. It's not easy. It's not easy. I'm not going to go to the information. I'm going to get... 伝説の情報屋の話かそうだ知ってたかああサイの話この街のことは何でも知ってるって噂の情報屋だ We're gonna meet a very interesting person の公園の中だ The Flores 公園か I thought I was a very interesting person 通称サイの川だ Not as interesting as this guy やつはそのサイの川の中にいるらしい Kind of really puts up the, uh, I don't know, sort of John Wick, Bowery King sort of information network to shame. But actually, it's very similar to that, now that I think about it. Alright, well, let's got ourselves a bit of a lead. <laughs> go to purgatory. <laughs> you yeah, have to die. Right. Go to purgatory <laughs> as if it's like down the street from you. <laughs> <laughs> Now I forget, how does one get to purgatory? Is that like when, you, like, if you die and you're not... Baptized. Oh, okay. So it's like, it's like, for, it's like you, you like, think of it as like, like and I don't know what, there's other, uh, like in other religious traditions, there's other ways, but like in the Catholic way, it's sort of like if you were never baptized, but let's say like, for example, that you were like, a, just like the saintly good person, but you were never baptized. Then you would um, end up in purgatory. I see. So it's like it's not you're, you're not in heaven, but you're not in hell either. But, but again, you don't want to be in purgatory either. So. Yeah, purgatory doesn't sound like it's a lot of fun. It's not. But you know what's interesting is I've seen like a lot of like these movies nowadays. They have like portrayals of what hell is. One of them was this really. God, I'm trying to remember what it was called. I think it was like something like the. It's, something, it's, the, it's like the grouchy man or something like that. But what it is is this guy just takes a bus to this um, to this like weird town out in the middle of nowhere. And everything's like all gray and dusty. But he already has a job and a house and everything waiting for him. But the problem is, is that he... What's going on here? But um, I don't know. Yeah, the, but like... But the problem is, is that like everything just seems very flat. Oh, oh God! <laughs> Jesus! Nani? <laughs> Aren't I just like Majima Kazuha? I keep. You know, popping up and irritating you and then fighting you. <laughs> I don't know. I can't decide what would be worse. <laughs> He's just like. It's so weird, because, yeah, he just does this throughout the entire game. Oh my goodness, I am like Majima. No, because, see, he let me, he, he, he let me go. <laughs> but... I let you go. After a long, 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 long... So actually, I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna actually show you what happens. But what you're what you're supposed to oh that I just on oh yeah oh so yeah this what I just found right here is is a uh, 
yes, it, 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 it is a very sexy card, but like... <laughs> This is actually another mini game. So remember the uh, the cat scratch game in the last one? I don't know if you watched that up to that, but um, but like there's a uh, but like there's like a rock paper scissors game that um, there, there's like a rock paper scissors mini game that you play in the uh, in Yakuza Zero that's really BS. So yeah, I, I yeah yeah this one this one they they've completely revamped it. And um, yeah, they 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 uh, put it they put it so that way there's a little bit more strategy involved. So it's not so much a you know just more of like a, a test of luck. But so it's you all... actually have a chance. Of, so you actually have a chance of winning. Then. I do, yeah. Yeah. So. Yep. So we just go in there for Mesa King. I might as well show this off. Just so you can see what it looks like. <laughs> it can really be appealing to adults too. This is a very odd thing for me to be doing, but all right. Ah yes. So yeah, so we get we get our we get our choice of like move we get like a move set that um that can uh help that can help with the uh with 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 your with your character and you can make it strong and it makes it, you know, much easier to, to do these rock, paper, scissors battles. Plus also Oh yeah. Oh no, I was gonna say plus also your opponents your your opponents you actually fight against people but they have like specific strategies that they use, so it's also not as frustrating too. But now you're making me think of Dragon Ball Z with the Ginyu Force. <laughs> <laughs> wait, why would that? Wait. Rock paper scissors. Oh, oh, oh! My God, I forgot. I, I, I forgot yeah. about that. You know, you know. Again, they like. I've watched uh, DBZ abridged so much, and they didn't, and they never, and they never talked about that, <laughs> which is funny because it would have been hilarious. But uh, yeah. So that means that I can annoy you. No. <laughs> you have to like, you have to relent sometimes. Uh, no, I don't. I never have to. So yeah, let's just. So I'm just gonna show off what one of the matches looks like. Um, uh. I don't know. There's a lot. Of, there's a lot in this game that like, and th that I do respect about like all the uh, Yakuza games is that even though they do repeat a lot of the same, um, a, a lot of the same uh, video game, um, like same mini games that they've been playing, like. There, there's a, uh, uh, you know, it's just, it's, it's just pretty fun to watch and play through. Especially, so I'll show off like some of the newer games, so like this, so like this one, where we get to see something that might get me demonetized. <laughs> so yeah, so we get these stats here. But if you also notice, funny enough, these are the exact same models that they used for the Cat Scratch game in the original, in uh, Yakuza 0. This, of course, was not something that was present in the original, <laughs> in the original game. I didn't think it was. <laughs> but I was like, I would have remembered that if, if this bug game was in this. <laughs> so let's see. So yeah, your um, your the the flashing move, of course, means like the move that you're strongest in. So when you're fighting opponents, and also, so what's what's nice about this is that like you'll see that like all of them are flashing now, which means that my next move, no matter what it is, is going to is going to take them down if uh, if it lands. But the thing is, is that also this was a practice match, so that's why you know, I was able to beat it to beat. The professor so easily. That's a big 
Gambling stuff too. Like they make you know the initial thing so easy, or you win first, like ooh, and then you keep putting your money in, and then you lose. Well, it's pretty funny because like in this game, like the uh, like so like my next opponent that um, I would fight is a kid who does <laughs> who who takes the Bart Simpson strategy to rock paper scissors, which is the ah rock, good old rock, nothing beats rock. <laughs> But, uh, so that's the idea of the Mesa King game. I, I like it a lot better, and actually, that's one of the uh, Majima challenges, too, so. And now we can find Mesa King cards just scattered all over the city. Just like Ellie can find trading cards of superhero things. <laughs> In Last of Us Part 2. It is funny that I'm, like, alternating between a game where everything is destroyed and a game where everything is sparkly. <laughs> Okay, so what I really wanted to do here is because I wanted to buy a, um... Oh, hey, I can buy some Mesa King cards. Uh, where is it? Okay, uh... Let's, uh, let's get the wooden... Or... Uh... Nah, we'll go with the wooden katana. So, I gotta have a, I gotta have a weapon on me when I go visit Majima. And I, and, um... Yeah, I'm a, yeah, I kind of just want to show this off. But uh, let's go ahead and equip that. Now I have myself a sword. Which, funny enough, in this game, Kiryu will finally know, learn how to how to actually hold a uh, samurai sword. So it will. So it um. It will. So like it uh. <laughs> so so now it now it will do like tons more damage. Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna need to spend some time off stream just grinding, just so that way I can get some, I can get more a a XP. Cause right now my character uh, is not as strong as he could be. I guess I didn't appreciate the amount of times that you fought off screen. <laughs> no, no, you never do. But then again. I find it hard to appreciate most things in life, don't I? That's a very sad thing to say, but, you know... You do you, man, if you want to sit and just anger all day, fuming, like you normally do. Alright, Majima. Again, it's what you love about me. So once I, so once, um... <laughs> yep, there it is. Some contraband shit. Kiryu-chan, you're out! He found it. <laughs> Not good, Kiryu-chan. What are you thinking walking around in public with a dangerous item like this? As an officer of the law, I gotta make sure you pay for your crimes. It's in my very moral fiber. You should remind, like, Majima, it's like, isn't it illegal to impersonate an officer, Majima? <laughs> he is an officer. <laughs> like, a legit sworn officer? No, he is not, but, like, I think, I think he probably... <laughs> But see now, now there's I'm fighting his. There's a bit of hypocrisy going on there, isn't there? Yeah. Again, this is what Majima does to fuck with me. So. <laughs> oh Jesus! Oh Jesus! Oh Jesus! So yeah, if you notice, we he's fighting in his slugger style from the Yakuza Zero. What? 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 
me or a big Oh, god damn it. Huh? Mugger. Oh, yeah, that was from that Macaulay Coke and Richie Rich, remember? Hi, a slugger. Oh, yeah. And then, of course, you know, the, the guy, when he, when he eats that raw thing of cookie cook, it's just like, oh. That was a very weird movie. Well, you know, it was based off of a comic, right? Yeah, no, it was. It was, wasn't the comic, like, from, like, the 50s or something? Yeah. Yeah, they make you fight Majima a lot. Once you get the tiger drop, though, from the, uh, from your dragon style, Majima becomes almost completely irrelevant because you can just spam the tiger drop on him. Which, you know what? I just realized I never explained. The tiger drop is uh, one of your most powerful moves that you can get in in the game, and Kiryu keeps forgetting it. <laughs> so, because you have to keep re -er you have to keep relearning it. <laughs> So, <laughs> but yeah, so the reason why Majima is all doing this is again, because he wants to, he, he just wants you to, to get back to where you used to be. So that way he can finally fight you for real. There is a method to his madness, but he is totally insane. Uh, that sounds like something that I would do to you. You would consistently fight me? No, but I would, like, consistently annoy you. You do which that now! What, which, well, I mean, which is essentially what Majima's doing. Well then, what, well, then what are you... What are you going to be... <laughs> then, then, let me ask you this, then. What is what is annoying me gonna do for me that, that'll improve my, 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 my physique? As Calvin... Well, not your physique, but as Calvin's dad says, it builds character. And what kind of character did you want me to build? One that pretty much does what I say when I say so. It just gives me an iron plate? What the hell, man? Oh. Cool. So, yeah, we only have a couple more minutes left, so I, uh, I think I will... I, I, I think I won't go back, go to the West Park, but, um... <laughs> I'm out of here. Please, wait, wait, wait! Please! I mean it! See? One teensy drink! I swear it will be worth it! Jesus. <laughs> but if this isn't an amazing drink, I'm walking. <laughs> wow, they really... They really reopened this bar already? <laughs> People need their drinks in Japan. Many. Oh, God damn it! <laughs> You see, Kazuo, I am just like Majima. No, you don't! <laughs> you do not have a wardrobe full of costumes that you would randomly change into. No, but I do pop up and, you know, bother your life when you prefer me not to. Goro, 40 years old. <laughs> it's, it came out last year. It's got a real spooky... 
<laughs> yeah, this is just Jack, dude. <laughs> does have a classic taste, pretty good. But see, uh. listen, see, at least Majima's giving me a free drink. When you're up here, I cook for you, man. That's true. Oh, you don't give me free drink. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> Five hundred sixty thousand yen. <laughs> Great value, eh? <laughs> That's robbery. I only had two drinks. Why is it so expensive? Well, it's some really legit best-in-class premium whiskey. Matter's a fact, it usually runs in the 5,600,000 yen. Oh. What? <laughs> but but I would walk 500,000. <laughs> I would walk 500. You know what's funny is that video was randomly recommended to me huh? on my on, on on my YouTube again. Like I was like, holy crap! I haven't watched this video. So there's this video. Um, it's 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 kind of it's kind of funny. There's this video of this guy took a still image of Mount Rushmore, animated the mouths, and animated the mouths to this audio for this one acapella group who sang a cover version of 500 Miles by the, pro uh, uh, by the pro uh, Proclaimers. And to be honest, it's probably my favorite cover of that song I have ever heard. And because I, I honestly didn't care for the original that much. But like, I don't know. Yeah, it's one of those songs where it's like I like the cover. I, I, I found myself liking a lot of covers more. I guess that's like Bob Dylan. <laughs> How many times? <laughs> well, this is all just pretty much an excuse to to fight to fight me. So, well, you guys got to see another Majima fight. I didn't expect I'd run into another one so soon. But yeah, soon. But sooner or later, once you so. Yeah, so, yeah, so like he'll so you can you can fight him you can actually even fight Majima uh, through Mesa King as well. Oh yeah. Boop to the head. Yeah. Oh Jesus! Oh, he's fighting his—he's fighting his his uh, breaker style, the breakdance style. <laughs> yeah, the breakdance style can be a little like, irritating when he—if he—if he actually gets his move, like gets to be able to do the combos. So much like how. It was with the uh, with him in Yakuza Zero. You want to beat him. You want to try to interrupt the combos. Otherwise, yeah, <laughs> he can do a lot of damage super fast. But the good thing about Majima, though, is that like if you if you lose if you lose to him, which you will sometimes, because like he will come at an opportune moments, especially when he starts hiding in the city, <laughs> and he'll still pop out whether or not you're ready. Like, sometimes you'll find him walking, and you can just, like, fight him then, but, like, yeah. I, I, I can't hear you. Oh. Oh, no. Sorry, can you hear me now? Yeah. So, I was just gonna say, I feel like, in a way, that's exactly how I would be. If I were super wealthy, like if I was like a billionaire or something, right? And like I did, I didn't need to work anymore, and like all my like businesses were pretty much handled by like boards and whatever, and I could just like sit there and do just what I want with and rake in money. 
breaking money, you know, like, if, I think, I, I think that's how I would be, like, a bore, or it's just, like, I, it's, like, I wouldn't be evil in terms of, like, squid game-wise, but I would just, like, like, just follow you around, like, randomly, random places and just pop up and just, you know, like, like, cause annoyance in your life and everything, but then, like, you know. I don't know, Tadal. You sound like you might be on the downward slope to a squid game, because eventually that's going to stop getting irritating, so then you start, you know, you, you know, that's going to stop being fun for you, and then eventually you're going to start you, uh, escalating to the point where you're like, man, I might need to start actually killing people, and then you'll make your own squid game. Nah, I, 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 I don't know, dude. Then again, yeah, you never bet on like prize fights, so, and you like you have no knowledge of any fighters. Neither do I, for that matter. But <laughs> anyways, I think um yeah, so I think that'll be the stream for now. Uh. We got to end on a pretty funny note with Majima, but trust me, he will get more outrageous. Amazingly, I will try Just to. Like me. I will try to show off the the more crazier ones, and some of them are actually quite hilarious. I'm a but um. <laughs> but yeah, with each time you fight him, he will get better. So, uh, no, you, you get better. Sorry, I, I, I gotta rephrase that. But, um, yeah, anyways, I will be back tomorrow with more of The Last of Us. So, um, the other thing that I wanted to bring up, unfortunately, uh, this week, uh, I will not be able to stream. My work has decided that it's time for everybody to do more overtime. So, we, uh, so I'm gonna be stuck doing that for a while. So, I won't be able to stream, um... Pretty much um, after Tuesday, I won't be able to stream until next Monday. So, uh, yeah, that's unfortunate. But, um, yeah, but anyways, but I will be back tomorrow with more of The Last of Us. So, take care, everyone.